students who come from different parts of the city uh, and they belong to different social status family. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and uh, I would like to know if you, if you notice they, uh, they are concerned to this principle of sustainability, sustainability like participation, uh, social justice or solidarity among them. For example, according to their reality, not my personal impression is that uh, uh, the majority of the students think of sustainability as uh, something related uh, with the respect to the natural environment, mm -hmm. not to the social uh, way of living or whatever, or uh, a way of, uh, of um, making decisions or something mm -hmm. like that. Mm -hmm. uh, but more related to the to the to nature itself. Yeah, to clean yeah. the environment. So the to physical to, environment. Yeah. yeah. Animals, plants, whatever, you know, the, the whatever. So I don't think they they uh, associate this uh, another point of view of sustainability to the concept of sustainability. Mm -hmm. But I think they are concerned with the importance of uh, Making decisions in a group, taking uh, taking into account the, the the opinion of everyone, or, or they trying are, to look for decisions that are valid for all the group or these things. Yeah, they are respectful. No? We saw that with this collaboration. Sometimes they are. Sometimes. <laughs> sometimes they are not. But I think they consider that it is important, and they also maybe they are not, but they they try to prepare. A, Actions with children, which uh, promote uh, the respect uh, among the children, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, even though they sometimes they do not do among them. You know, mm -hmm. but they, they many people have the idea quite clear, but uh, but the way of uh, transforming it into an action uh, uh, varies from if you are part of the system. Of the system are the children, you know. Mm -hmm. So uh, maybe it's uh, a little bit coherent. How did you facilitate these uh, actions for them to to develop good practices of sustainability education? I first because you teach uh, physics and chemistry. I teach sciences uh, science. and also things related to the knowledge of the natural environment mm -hmm. and didact didactics and all that. Mm -hmm. mm, I try to give uh, an external vision of things they do. For example, if they, if they prepare an activity, I try to, to give my, my point of view mm -hmm. from outside somehow, you know, mm -hmm. and, and I try to promote the uh, uh, reflection about everything, mm -hmm. uh, thinking about what yeah, we do and is. how we do and all that. And Method. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, and I also provide them uh, with different techniques that uh, may help to, to work in a team or to prepare an activity with uh, more impact or whatever you do. Did you, for example, when preparing this, this sort of activities, promote or give them the idea uh, uh, to take into account related to social impacts. For example, when you are working in an, an environmental no? uh, action or repercussion or, uh, on, on a film, no? do you think, take into account the social aspect and how the community uh, around this problematic environmental issue are suffering or, or how they how they act or they can act in favor to to a more satisfactory resolution or mm. uh, yeah we 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 have a uh, we use different methods to, to, to learn, and one of them is the case studies. Mm -hmm. And I was thinking now you, you were telling this, 
a case study that is a school that is gonna that they can use a, a, a forest going near the school and there are gonna be some changes in the forest which is going to transform it in a park mm -hmm. so through this uh, case we study how the how is the influence gonna be on the different parts of the community, the children, the teachers, the, the town itself. So we try to use uh, empathy, 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 to 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 be conscious of uh, how a change in in whatever is gonna affect different uh, uh, different aspects of reality of. Uh, human reality or other things. So yeah, with some so, things we try to think on a systematic uh, um, vision. Mm -hmm. So in this sense uh, you, uh, you organize a holistic no, project because you take into consideration no, uh, their point of view from the different participants of this community. No? Yeah. No, not all the time, but you, sometimes we do that. Do you use yeah. the role play uh, when, yeah, when you are developing yeah. or putting into practice this sort of activity? Yeah, but students are, are shameful people. Yeah? So, not with children, but yeah. among them, they yeah. 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 have a lot of shame, yeah. so it's like... Yeah, we are embarrassed. Yeah, yeah. enough yeah. 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 information. Enough yeah. information. Yeah. It's a question of the lack of For example, ICT, is not the subject itself, no? it's just a common tool, like a way of planification to, or the methodology no? in, in, in the class. No? But do you think that, for example, teachers have uh, enough knowledge no? to develop ICT uh, as, a, as a tool, a common tool in their, in their, in their class? If they have not passed an, an exam or or they have not uh, formation before, I think sustainable education no, will have the same or would be the same. No. Well, I I uh, I think that teachers should know about it and should know should know mm -hmm. uh, such as to as to know when and how and who should do different things related to it. Mm -hmm. But I so for the program it too much. Yeah. Because it would be like a skill, no? Yeah, like, like another skill. skill. Mm -hmm. like, like in life. Mm -hmm. uh, I know it's hard to do. Uh, nobody knows how, knows how to do it. But maybe what I understand of what you say is that it should be uh, a first step. If you prepare a subject on this, then you could evolve it and, uh, or, and make it wider. Uh, mm -hmm. 